Coming, uh, what's that song? I have no idea what that song oh, was. So, something fun that occurred 91X FM. I got interviewed yes. and I got to pick different songs of different things, got questioned on, and stuff like that. And it was aired when Google was completely down everywhere around the world. Oh. So, that's why nobody could listen to it. <laughs> Aww. So, <laughs> they're going to replay it again on the 27th, 91XFM. Tune in. You can live stream. Hopefully, Google won't be down around the world. And, um, and or you, if you have a radio, because, like, nobody has radios anymore. <laughs> Everybody listens to it on their devices. We almost had to go to the car to listen to it. We did. And then we're like, oh, we do have a little radio. So, we got that out. <laughs> yeah. Otherwise, we were going to drive around in our car for an hour. <laughs> fun. So it was a lot of fun. And um, it was uh, Kevin ba Basker, who is the host, is just funny. And, and he's yeah. a really nice guy. He's a fellow Rotarian. So he was the one that interviewed me. So it was fun. To go, so go tune into that. You'll get to hear mm -hmm. some of Tara's favorite songs. <laughs> Don't of forget. Relate. <laughs> yeah, don't forget <laughs> this week to like share subscribe comment and comment on our christmas tree um mm -hmm. contest which is still going on until next week yep we're going to be announcing the winners to have donation money donated and mm -hmm. um i still believe it's fake news that um somebody is leading the way in this <laughs> who Just could it so be i don't know <laughs> I just don't we'll have know. To stay tuned and find stay out. Tuned. Right. Trying to keep the the Christmas spirit about this, <laughs> but it's not working. I'm just just getting, we're just getting my trees getting hammered so badly. <laughs> they are, and I, what's really exciting? All the people that are putting pictures up of yeah. their trees. Yeah, They're beautiful. Yeah. Now we, yeah. the four of us. Are gonna have a really difficult time to decide. We, we might are. just have to put all the names in a hat and draw. Yes. Yeah, yeah. The 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 turnout's been amazing. Thank you, yeah. everybody. It yeah, and I love all the comments that say that their kids are helping and just little facts about the tree too. That's really nice to read. Yeah, they all it's look a so lot of beautiful. Fun. I think we'll have to do this again next year. It's a lot of fun. Maybe we'll do wreaths on the door or something. Hey, mm -hmm. send us your ideas. What you'd like to see? Yes. Yeah, something that Julie won't be good at. <laughs> and that Tom will excel at, like so something electronic. I don't know, I don't messy know. hair or something like that. <laughs> Contest for messiest hair. Like that. Oh, I can beat you on that one too. I think <laughs> <laughs> that would be funny. We this has been a see. bad year. Like I brush it in the morning, and it's still like <laughs> I don't know what happens to it. So we've got a few things going on. Interest rates. 0.99 never nine. In the nine nine <laughs> never in the history of canada have we had an interest rate that low like never what is that five-year variable i think right? no that that was the variable yeah that was the variable and then the, fixed the variable. rates are anywhere yeah. from and then the fixed is like 1.79 yeah. 1.59 to 1.7 but the, the but the headline is 0.99 percent, like less than a percent. We talked about it last week that that it was coming out, and yeah, money's free. Mm -hmm. Money for Lots nothing. Your checks are free. People are refinancing right now to get that lower rate. Um, so that's a good time to to get that done. So if you're, I mean, it's it's we're going to talk about listings in a minute. But if you have a lot of equity in your home and money is cheap, it is a great time to decide to pick up an investment property. It's true. Just Lots of saying. people picking up investments right now. <laughs> yeah, with, like, with, with homes going up in value the way they are and interest rates being as low as they are, there is, there is um, opportunity there. Most definitely. And, and a huge shout out, if I may, to my brother, 
that just purchased his first investment property as well. So he took advantage of uh, the market right now and uh, very proud. Good job, Douglas. Yeah. <laughs> it's, uh, it's an interesting time because we have, uh, we have such a shortage in homes. So if you are looking at wanting to sell because, you know, you're moving out of the area or you're moving in with family, you want to combine some families. A lot of people are doing that right now, especially with COVID in our future. Um, so they're not alone. Then this is a really great time to get listed. And it's any time. You don't need to wait for the spring. Uh, we have buyers uh, galore right now because they're all in, in competing offers. And uh, so it's a good time to, to buy and a and good time serious. to sell. And they're really? serious. Mm-hmm. Nobody trapes around in the winter. <laughs> Just <Nope>. fun. <laughs> they nope. are serious buyers for sure. Yeah. It's very true. So yeah, so that's all great. Um, we've got a couple of businesses we're going to talk about today. Oh yes, we are. <laughs> so one of them is, uh, oh my gosh, hands down my favorite patio, the boathouse. Oh my goodness, have you guys been there? The oh, boathouse is choice. so delicious. Yeah. Wow, I feel like the patio makes it feel like you're out of you're you're out of town, like you're not even in Belleville, like on the water and yep. the sunsets and you know watching people on their boats. It's a beautiful place, and I know right now they're taking um, serious protocols with COVID. You can still dine in, um, but they have the separation. Uh, they're taking full force to make sure everyone is safe. Um, is it okay if I talk about alcohol in here? Because my favorite is the peach. Bellini so good every time I go there it's like a tropical drink so good but yeah the boathouse is wonderful um then they do also do um the free entree on your birthday up to a $15 value which is wonderful um good time to go on your birthday but I was gonna say it um Oh, so maybe that's a spot where you need to go. Oh, Tom's up here for me. <laughs> I know right. we're all pointing in different directions. I know this is you down here and Julie and Tom. <laughs> I need to do the Brady Bunch thing. It's like, I'll look over. I gotta look down for Tara. <laughs> I'm looking um, sideways at you. <laughs> but yeah, <laughs> and then uh, they, they actually still had their party open until uh, I think it was like November the 8th or the 18th because it was so beautiful out. Yeah, so they still have their doors open, which is wonderful. We've had a gorgeous fall and beginning of winter. Yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And our other business this week is Loyalist Martial Arts Academy, located in Belleville, just off Sydney Street. They are a super, it's a wonderful place. Nicely, it's all basically new, wide open space, great setup. Uh, they do uh, Muay Thai, they do Bra- Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, women's only kickboxing, some boxing, um, tons of different martial arts for adults, for kids, uh, really great coaches, super friendly staff. Um, they do some great um, summer camps, uh, some PA day camps for the kids, uh, really great organization and uh, some really great people. So if you're and looking to get some martial that? arts in there. Yeah. And didn't Blake have his birthday party there one year? He did at, uh, at their old location. We had a Nerf birthday party. That's awesome. Oh, that's fun. So fun. It looked like fun. It was so yeah. fun. Yeah. So awesome people. Check them out. And- you know what people especially coming into winter are looking for things for their kids to do right Mm -hmm. so um it's a it's a great option for you to get your kids out and active and you know having something a little different all covid safe you know you have to wear the masks in and out of the building and you work with kind of a bubble of uh of kids or you can work on you know your own with uh like a heavy bag kind of thing so they have all those precautions set up and in place so that everybody's safe you know what, we're what, eight, nine months into this now. And uh, hey, kudos, the fact that we have vaccines coming out. That's incredible to have those coming out in less than a year. Um, But companies and businesses and restaurants, they they're all on board now with this whole um, COVID way of life. And we're going to be this way, even with the vaccines coming out, we're going to live this way, at least for the next year. And there may be some of these things and items that change for many, many years to come. So Mm -hmm. You know what? Kudos to all those businesses and companies and places that are doing that. Mm-hmm. So, 
even with our numbers on the rise, we just have to remember um, as the public to also maintain these same protocols. Yep. Definitely. And I know we keep saying this through each video, but if you are a local restaurant or a business and you want to come on here, we can Zoom with you. Uh, yep. We would love to hear from you. Uh, we love supporting the local businesses and we try and gain some momentum through our videos. So yes, if you're watching and you're interested, uh, comment, uh, send us a message and we would absolutely love to hear from you. Yep. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Okay, everybody, remember, go on to I Love Babel Facebook page and uh, take a look and vote for your favorite Christmas tree. There's three options up there. And uh, also post a picture of yours so that you can get in the draw for the, for the donation win. Yep, we're giving away $200, $100 for the tree that you guys pick and another $100 for the tree that we pick of yours. And it all goes to charity. Yep. You get to pick the charity of your choice. We get to pick the charity of our choice and the charities win, which is really important. Yep. So oh, I guess. Oh, one more quick thing that I just thought of while you're on our, I love Belleville Facebook page and you've worked with us, you love us, you're happy with us. Mm. Feel free to recommend us while you're there. There's a little recommend tab. We'd love to, you know, people look at those comments and, and that rating uh, yep. when they're looking for a realtor. So if you want to give us a quick recommendation, we would absolutely love it. Yes. <laughs> that hurt. Because we love you. <laughs> All right. We are going to uh, have one more tour Tuesday for the end of 2020. And we're going to say goodbye to 2020 in one week. That, that, and, that's all, folks. And that's, <laughs> so we'll see y'all on the 22nd. Tuesday. 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 Tuesday.